Hi there Scorpio, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm going to be doing your October 2017 monthly reading. I have pre-shuffled these four decks for you. This is intended to be a general reading. Whatever comes out, comes out. This may or may not resonate with everybody as it's for hundreds and thousands of people. Again, this is for Scorpio for the month of October. All right, the center of your reading is the Six of Cups. That's about nostalgia. It's also about reminiscing about the past. That is the basis of your reading. So you may be thinking about somebody from the past. <coughs> All right, we do have um, a Capricorn here. We have Capricorn. We have um, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have the air signs, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and we have the fire sign. So it could be any sign. You could be thinking about somebody from the past. I don't see the um, Taurus and Virgo yet, though. Okay. So anyway, I see you thinking about somebody from the past, reminiscing. Maybe you're even thinking about your childhood, okay? Um, you may be... Somebody could be... Um, watching you from afar or you could be watching them from afar on social media or um, you know kind of like an online stalking kind of thing somebody could be checking you out you could be checking them out I see that um, we do have quite a bit of fire energy here so I'm thinking uh, Leo Aries or Sagittarius I do see that there's some uh, there could be a new love okay or a resurgence of, of a relationship because we have the page of cups and the ace of cups here so I mean you may be thinking about a new beginning with somebody from the past that could be the case or they could be thinking about a new beginning with you uh, we do have the tower right up there as the first card that is a false foundation okay I often call the tower the universe when the universe comes in it it um, throws you know out um, a bang of some sort that causes the false foundation to crumble all right so that is at the beginning of the month something could crumble so just beware um, there could be some words said there could be some spitefulness some hastiness some harsh opinions that come out there could even be some forcefulness somebody could try to be forceful towards you you know and try to force their views onto you um, I do see that you will you will still have your guard up and be on top and you'll just, you'll be able to uh, shut them down pretty quickly you know and just be like you know hell with you you don't even know what you're talking about or something like that you know um, you are on top and you know it all right, so I do see that there's some desires here with the devil card. There could be some obsessions, could be sexual desires with the page of wands right next to it. You know, I de there's definitely some desires this month. And there could, along with this, these a lot desires, there could be some, some love. Um, there could be a need for recuperation, though, and I'm not sure what that is over. Maybe so there's some addictions and... Things might there might be a little bit of overindulging, and some some of you might need to take, to take time to rest um, and recuperate. Could be from an illness, even, um, or just you know you know a hangover type of thing that comes and goes pretty quick. I do see some very hasty energy here, though, where um, people might not be really thinking about the consequences of their actions. So be on guard, okay. 
um, I, with the world card right above this this six of cups which is the basis of your reading we have the world card that says that you are about to start a new chapter of your life or you just have or you're going to in the near future I think something has reached an end and you are about to start something new which is long term okay um, and it could be love and there could be a lot of attraction whatever this is there's a lot of um, pull towards it whatever it is this this new chapter involves a lot of um, excitement, put it that way. Um, let me get the next deck. There's some kind of discovery here that is pretty exciting this month. And I'm not sure what this is, but it looks like if there's some excitement. Um, could be with another person, could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. There's excitement with this person. And there's a pretty strong, you know, there's there could be some love there as well with this person. And somebody might not be happy about it. That's That could definitely be the case. They just, you know, don't want to give up or something. I think somebody might not be happy with your excitement and feelings for somebody else. This came out Queen of Swords. Well, let's just reiterate what I'm saying, exactly what I'm saying. Somebody isn't happy about it. And this could be, you know, anybody that has this energy that may be saying things without thinking, very spiteful energy, very um, opinionated, harsh, not really caring about anybody's feelings but their own. So there could be some um, spiteful um words because of your newfound excitement and somebody might not be very happy about that it could be a cancer okay we do have a cancer here but we also have this can also mean putting yourself in the driver's seat this means you mastering your emotions moving forward could be moving house physically moving period it gets moving making a move taking action putting yourself in the driver's seat i'm done i'm gonna start over now someplace else you know i'm i'm moving on six of cups this is reminiscing about somebody from the past now somebody from the past could be the one that just will not give up just saying that could be the case and a lot of this it could be that somebody from the past just will not give up and you can't and that's the basis of your reading that you you still have this past lingering that will not leave you alone that could be the case and I see this chariot comes out that says it's time for you to take the lead it's time for you to be the boss it's time for you to to put yourself in the driver's seat and take the lead in the situation Eight of Wands, and you need to do it quickly, okay? This is fast-moving energy. This is you need to do it quickly. Something needs to happen pretty fast. You're going to need to nip it in the bud very quickly, okay? The Empress. This is a time of rebirth for you. This is a time of renewal. This is a time for you to start fresh, okay? And, and I think that's why you need to put yourself in the driver's seat because it is time for you to start fresh. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, okay? So this is could be the person that is hindering you. This could be the person that just won't let go. Or this could be the person that is in your life now, okay? Could, could go either way. Either way, this person um, doesn't give up very easily, all right? You have the Three of Cups underneath it. Perhaps um, there's a third party situation somewhere. There could have been, I'm just saying, this could resonate with some and not for all, okay? Some of you could be involved in a third party situation where you um, have to make a choice between two people, all right? Just saying.
There's definitely going to be some words said. That's for darn sure. Okay, and the words could hurt this this month. Okay, there could be, and it could happen throughout the month. I mean, it could be a a month of going back and forth with kind of like blah blah bickering. You know what I mean? Like just I don't know. You're definitely going to have to take control of the situation. That's all there is to it. Page of Coins, Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So this could be the person you're dealing with as well. It could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces, or this could be you. All right. Putting yourself in the driver's seat. You have to. You must. Because this is just, there's too much. There's too many conflicts here. This is conflicts. There's too many conflicts. It's like a constant battle. You always have to have your swords drawn because you never know what to expect next. You have all the tools within you. You do. You have all the tools within you to get through this. That's the magician. As above, so below. When I say all the tools, you are a, you are a master of your emotions. Maybe you have forgotten that you are and you just need to bring that back as above so below this is the magician this is just a reminder that you have all the tools inside of you in case you have forgotten i am here to remind you that you do have them you can master your emotions you can be victorious you can be triumphant you do know what to do you have the answers within you how to handle the situation okay there's too much conflict. There's, there's, there's some kind of conflict and tension here that needs to be nipped in the bud. Okay? This right here, this Two of Cups, this is a strong attraction to somebody. A strong, strong attack, attraction. Like a, a, a serious bond. Okay? And I think that a lot of you over this Three of Cups, and I think that there may be a choice between two people. I do. And you need to nip one of them in the bud. That's what I see. I mean, that's what I see. I mean, that's not for everybody, but that's for some of you. Could be a choice between two jobs because this is a general reading. Could be between two people. Could be a child and a parent. You know what I mean? There's a choice that needs to be made. Okay? Um, and I think that there's been a lot of illusion, a lot of dreaming. I think somebody, you know, there's been a lot of investment in something. And that's why somebody just doesn't want to give up. But we have these sevens here. And sevens are about faith and trust. And I'm not sure if you had that in your weekly reading or not. But you must have faith and trust in yourself and your abilities to succeed. Because this is success. You're going to be successful no matter what. And whatever it is you want. You're going to be successful because you have all the tools within you. There's no failure at all here. None. You, you, there's no way you can fail because of the tools that you have. All right. And things that, you know, there's things are, this page of pentacles says that you have, there's been delays on a situation because of some kind of illusion of some sort. I'm not sure what that is, but there's been delays and the page of pentacles comes out to say it's time to start that new foundation. It's time to move forward. You need to look at something from a new perspective, okay? Um it's also a very practical, responsible um kind page, okay? So this is saying that's that's an energy that you want to take on during this. All right? Because you're going to, somebody's, you could, uh, with all these swords, the Queen of Swords, you have that twice, and the King of Swords, and you have the Page of Swords. With all that energy, something could happen that is very spiteful, you know, and very hurtful. And you might, you know, you're going to have to master your emotions and really nip it in the butt. Look to your inner strength. Interesting. I'm going to zoom that in. Whoops. Sorry about that. I hit it. 
Okay. Look to your inner strength. Number 11. Look to your inner strength. You are stronger than you realize. Remember I said you've forgotten what you have. You, I needed to remind you. You are stronger than you realize. The angels are asking you to dig deep inside of your inner self. The strength is in you. Though it may not feel like it right now, you will be able to push through this. Believe in yourself and know that you have the power within you. Those birds are talking to you. And they just stopped? What the hell? <laughs> they did that the whole time I was reading that and now they're okay interesting anyway wow I'm going to try to read that again you are stronger than you realize the angels are asking you to dig deep inside of your inner self the strength is in you Though it may not feel like it right now, you will be able to push through this. Believe in yourself and know that you have the power within you. That's what I have, Scorpio. Maybe it's time to fly away. I mean, what do those mean? That's what the chariot does. It flies away and you have it right here. Where is it? Is that it? Yeah, that's it. That flies away. That's what he does. That's a darn good message, isn't it? <laughs>